Hello guys, Sisigat here and welcome back to Equestrian the game. Are you ready for some new falls today? They are all ready. We gotta go right over to the falls. Let's click into here and have a look. A fall has been born. I'm not sure if this is the fjord horse or if that's the middle or the last one. We will see. Reveal! We will not see the potential here though. <laughs> Ooh. This is interesting because it must be this one that is from the both of the fewer horses, but it has totally different coat. I will check later. <laughs> All right, second one reveal. Oh, we got the white one. No. J must be one of the horses in here because she's white. <laughs> Third one! Let's go. What? <laughs> we got another one with this particular uh, combination. Even that I have got this now two or three times, I still get very excited for it because I have a sweet spot for this coat. And of course, then with this fjord mane, it's like, oh my gosh, so we have two horses with fjord manes this time. That's a filly, so that's a mare. Not so sure about this one. That was a colt. That's a stallion. But not sure about the middle one, but I will look back and I'll give him a name and then we will meet up again in the stable. All right, we are back in the stable and we're gonna have a look at the new horses. Felix actually is good. He is the new Fjord horse between Yente and Hector. He's green, which is a good thing. Aaron has blue, which is also very good, and Pixel. Uh, he must be a full Fjord horse, but now I got a little unsure because, yeah, he is a Norwegian Fjord horse. But he got a very interesting coat, actually. But let's have a look at his potential. Never mind. Green is not so good. Oh, I thought so. It's under 400. He can't have that anymore, unfortunately, even that he's super cute. So let's have a look at him. Untouchable. I'm not sure guild in quickness. Untouchable seem or sound like a negative thing, but obviously it isn't. <laughs> and come on. Balanced. Rhythmic, hard worker, his personality is perfect though. But he's balanced, but the potential... If we go so few weeks back, it was totally okay, but now we are focusing on 400 and up, really. Okay, it's the next horse right beside... Yup, Aaron! The white something? I'm not sure if he's a crossbreed or not. Very nice potential, 489. So let's see. He's a crossbreed between Jay and Rex. So let's see now on his personality. A natural gifted jumper, that's of course perfect. A, dem a dement ability to stay calm under stress, but a greater recovery time. Careful. That can be a good and bad thing, kind of. <laughs> it's gloomy and cold. Okay, the next one is Pixel. Super beautiful, must say. Which one is- <laughs> Fire is like standing next to her! Oh, uh, Like, Fire has 521, and then we go to Pixel, which is a higher horse. Obviously. What?! She had 468, and she was green! Same was the case with the Fjord horse, but he only got 360. This make no sense, you guys. The colors should be like giving or giving. Have you heard about that? Give a certain feeling about where the potential are. But pixel hair is perfect. 468. Duh. Okay. Athletic. Very good. Eccentric. Uh, light step. But this one. She's spooky or she gets easily nervous about certain things. That's not a good thing, but we can of course work around that as well. Her potential are perfect. 
and the code and the main <laughs> combination is perfect as well. Like, I have a sweet spot for this one. But of course, we can't get too many of them. <laughs> but I like her height, it's very good. Next to fire here, she looks actually quite huge. <laughs> they have the same coat, but not the same blaze, and not the same socks. But close, they are very close to be very similar. So yeah. Mm, unfortunately, you guys, we need to sell Hector and the other Fjord horse to get space for the new ones. <sighs> and we do have Arabian horses that has much higher potential and better personalities than Eren. Gonna, <laughs> unfortunately, sell some horses and we're gonna have a short look into the horse market to see if we have any horses there. And, um... Of course, take some new ones to breeding. I want more mares with good potential. Right now, again, I have more stallions than mares with good potential. So, we need to balance that a little bit. So, I'll be right back after I have sold some horses, unfortunately. Alright, you guys, we are officially in, in the horse market. And look here. Mare, Frisian. Very high overall potential. Cannot let this girl go, that's for sure, but we're gonna go through the carousel here just to see what we are dealing with. <laughs> oh, have you seen Thoroughbred? Not braiding mane and tail, try to look for that as well. 537, 2600, expensive. Welsh Cub, which we have not either right now. 519, Achilles, 11 years old, beautiful, perfect. <laughs> Pudu! Not so high overall potential. Swedish warm blood. Run 28. White. Beautiful as well. Wow. Well, this time that's very, like, unfair to me though. <laughs> so many beautiful horses. All right. Now we should have many good mares to choose from. Here we have the purple color. Yeah, one actually got this in the comment. Purple means very good. Lolo cat. <laughs> Did you see the name of the Frisian horse before I bought her? Okay, I need to change that name. We take Lottie, actually. It would be amazing if these two can get white with the Fjord main. Oh my gosh, it could be amazing, but it says that 100% chance for getting breathe. I didn't see the price before I already clicked. 3,000, you guys, for breeding these two. But we have 100% chance we get. <gasps> but it cannot be 100% chance we're getting the Fjord main. But we will have a very good look at these two when the breeding are done. <laughs> All right, next pair. <laughs> Cost 3,000 to breed these two as well. Last but not least, Pixel and Axel. Yente and Achilles. Oh, he has the same name as the, the, the older Arabian horse, actually. Lottie and Fire. Perfect. Horses. <laughs> but wow, wow, this episode actually got way out of time than planned, so we are totally out of time, but we have got some awesome horses. We have got horses on the in the purple league, if I can call it that. Purple color, which is I got a comment on that. It's the best ones, obviously. So I can't wait to see how they actually are in competitions themselves. So that I'm gonna test out and it's gonna be some amazing falls next time as well, especially the first pair gonna... Yeah, it was 100% chance for white. And if we can get a white horse with a fjord mane, that is also why it could be perfect. So, crossing my fingers for that, but we will see. So you guys, again, of course I'm gonna ask this question every time. What kind of falls have you got this week? What kind of tire have you got up to? And if you have any special things you want to share let me know in the comments below i still keep going with breeding and such and upgrading things uh the trailer is now on nine so that's close to getting to 10. the breeding facility is going up to six i think so we are getting there to upgrading everything to level 10 but it takes time because now it's expensive so yeah next week we're gonna continue with breeding again and see what kind of crazy falls we're gonna get i'm not crazy but crazy good maybe it's gonna be super awesome yeah 
So thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give me a thumbs up, share it with friends and family, and of course, subscribe to my channel for more videos from horse games, edits and drawings, and maybe some new games in the future as well. I had a Disney game on live stream on Sunday, and that was amazing, so like, like, maybe I will not put that game on hold. It's It was actually awesome. So yeah, we will see. <laughs> Bye!